Good day, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Ofense. Uh, welcome to Trendlines Trader. This is a YouTube channel where we do daily analysis. So, ladies and gentlemen, on today's date, we're gonna start with gold. Remember, today is the 8th of March, and on gold, our price has been very bullish. You can see this is our instrument, and we are on a daily, I mean, four hourly time frame. Our price has been giving us a very nice moves as we hope it will respect this, uh, this diagonal support. The price gave us this type of structure where we are having a diagonal support uh, towards the upside. And you can see this, it has been very bullish. Uh, let me show you here. Let me allow me to zoom in so that you can see. Just yesterday, the price just gave us this type of structure where it was consolidating. What I can tell, it looks like a bullish flag to me. I hope it does make sense to you guys that this consolidation looks like a bullish flag. The price might break uh, towards the upside, might break this top resistance so if it doesn't break this top resistance to push towards the upside i believe we will witness our price breaking this lower horizontal support and push towards our diagonal uh, support zone our ultimate support zone but you can see as much as it's been bullish we might see it pushing towards the upside i'm not gonna waste any time on on gold today because you can see it's still consolidating you will just have to wait for it to break and place our buys after retest whether it breaks uh, from the lower side or the upside okay ladies and gentlemen let's move to the next one our next instrument has been our next instrument is german 40. um I'm not feeling good today because the price has been making some unexpected moves but it's how the market moves. I don't make the market to move according to my way. I'm not a market mover but anyway I just have to trade on what I see. Our German 40 as we look at here this is our instrument we are on the 4 hourly time frame let's see where the price is taking us i want to show you something since the price has been bearish you can see where this type of moves during this war thing the price seems like it's bleeding the market is bleeding this nowadays so what i want you guys to notice is that the price broke out of this uh, channel the diagonal support our um, downtrend channel where we witness the retest and now it seems like it's at this support our price managed to find the support you can see that it's been respecting this area for quite some time as we might see the consolidation before we push towards the upside or maybe continue to uh, to go the downside to push to down towards the downside but let's say what we can expect if the price continue to respect this area as you can see at the with this one here let me zoom in so that you guys can be able to see very clearly what i'm trying to show you as you can see the price didn't or uh, still trying or will try to respect this area we can see that the price managed to find the support here and came to retest the nice seems to be pushing towards the upside or we might have consolidation before the price pushes towards the previous um support which is a uh, resistance when the price retested here the price came broke out of this area and came towards the downside to retest 
now if it does retest again it will be breaking to us the upside so let's just wait and see if our price you know my mouse is a little bit slow today i don't know is it the battery but anyway let's focus let's focus on the price the mouse thing will not hold us back you can see that the price came to retest this area and now it's about to push towards the upside and you can see here our candlestick this uh bearish candlestick it's left with three hours since we are on the four hourly time frame we are left with three hours uh for the price i mean for the candle to close after it closes we will see whether it's, it's closing bullish we will then say clearly this area is our support as it will be respected but if it closes towards the downside if it closes bearish we will say okay now it's about to retest or form in the consolidation around this uh, horizontal support okay ladies and gentlemen let's move to the next one our next candle will be us 100 everybody's favorite everybody's favorite this one is everybody's favorite let me reset this uh, chart so that you are able to see where i'm going with this one ladies and gentlemen we've been witnessing that our us 100 has been very bearish for quite some time now and you can tell that we've been having this type of structure where it was forming this uh, trend lines gave us these channels our price has been very bearish i hope you guys are able to see this you know i still can't believe the market really uh really overbought to such an extent i mean oversold to such an extent allow me to use the line chart so that i can be able to see exactly where i'm placing this where i am placing this yeah you can see that our price has been very very bearish as you can see well this type of moves where it was giving us the higher high and now the price decided to go lower low and lower high came back lower low lower high and lower here it didn't manage to break uh, this previous lower low but it ended up giving us something like higher high i mean higher low where it came back to give us our lower low so since the price managed to cancel this lower low created this new lower low it clearly shows that we've been bearish so gave us a higher low and now we were having a push towards the downside from yesterday i hope the price finds the support around this area i hope the price will respect this area and push towards the uh, diagonal resistance so that if the price pushes like this it will be giving us the signal of uh, now the chart what do you call the chart is about to change the character our structure is about to be changed as you can see the price will not be able to break this horizontal support and it will give us something like a changing um, those pattern where we will be saying it's a double bottom double bottom pattern then we will be waiting for the price to break towards the upside i hope you guys are able to understand what i'm trying to show you this is how the price moves we cannot make the price move according to our way anyway let's move closer to the price and see exactly what is happening around uh, this area right here because i believe this is another chart i mean channel that we still have to witness as you can see on our four hourly time frame the price 
oh i'm trying to make the price give us this type of channel yesterday i hope um and let me use the line chart when you push towards the when we push to uh to the lower time frame you can tell that this is a channel this is a type of channel we had yesterday the price was pushing towards the downside when you lose focus man you will end up losing money because the price if you don't see the channels will end up losing money in this industry of trading you can see here the price has been giving us this type of structure where it has been moving towards the downside this is our lower lower low and it gave us the higher high and push towards the downside lower low and higher high push towards the downside to create a lower low so since we are around this area i would like to see our price respecting this area as i was saying on the bigger time frame i hope if it does respect this area and push towards this um horizontal i mean diagonal resistance we might witness our price push towards the upside then we will be saying no now now it's time for buyers the buyers are in control but i don't see our price pushing towards the upside yet we might push towards the upside to this uh resistance a uh, diagonal resistance and the price if it respects this area we can say we are placing our selling positions as you can see the price has been very bearish i hope you guys are able to understand our price has been very bearish let's not waste any time on this channel on this instrument and let's move closer to our new instrument another instrument which is us 30 the price is bleeding ladies and gentlemen the price is bleeding allow me to use this you can see that the price is been very bearish for some for some time now as you can see with yeah uh, us 30 we are on the four four hourly time frame us 30 has been uh sailing for quite some time and we can see with the trend lines right here it is also bearish go well, i mean let's look at it on a line chart so that you can see this is how our price moves you can see here our price has been very bearish this is a channel that shows us that this is how the price has been moving this is another resistance that we are expecting uh, to break in future but for now we are well focused on this sailing sailing positions i mean sailing structures going back to the candlesticks i hope you guys are able to see what i'm trying to show you with this the price will be around this structure i mean this area soon let's hope our price will find a structure new stru i mean new area so about it let's hope our price will find a new area new support area around here and push towards the upside you know as when you are a buyer you are always looking for buying opportunities or you're always looking for those turning uh uh when the structure is about to turn or change the chart i mean the character where you can find uh those big bullish candlesticks we will be looking for a very bullish candlesticks but what i can say is if the price pushes towards the downside to come and reach the diagonal resistance i mean diagonal uh, support uh, support zone we can say our price is still very bearish because 
this is our lower low it uh, pushed towards the downside to reach this diagonal support to create an, uh, our new lower low but if the price doesn't uh, break uh, this <coughs> excuse me if the price doesn't break this area we will be saying now our price is about to move towards the upside this will be our changing uh, character changing structure as we will be witnessing it moving towards the upside but at the moment i can say we are still very bearish i hope this ukraine and russia news will be will be uh will change soon to give us something because the price now seems like it's about to respect this area let's push to the lower time frame and see where is our price going on one hourly time frame i can see our price is playing around this area to create the support let's hope it respects this area so that we can say now we are having a nice support i hope we might have something like this that's what i'm praying for if it doesn't if the price doesn't respect the area then it will break push towards the downside thank you very much ladies and gentlemen for watching this video i hope you guys do uh, subscribe click on the subscribe button below and uh, click on the like thumbs up so that we can reach other people who would like to use this information and please ladies and gentlemen don't forget to click on the bell so that you can be notified every time i upload a video i would like to say let's meet again on the next 